All right, so this I just got in the mail. It's a replacement remote for a, um, a Roku 4K smart TV. And it's exactly the same functionality. The only difference you may see is your quick set buttons for Netflix, Hulu, um, YouTube, and uh, Disney. These are the things I use the most, so I'm kind of glad that they're this way. But this is basically um, just like the um, the one that comes with the TV. You can buy two of these on Amazon, and they cost about <clears throat> 12 bucks. You don't get any batteries. You do get a couple of magnet things that you can, you know, put them on the side of your, uh, the side of your, um, <clears throat> you know, bed, po uh, you know, the end table, whatever you got. But what I'm going to show you today is how to change the batteries in them. All right. And, and the key thing is, is people have trouble getting this off of here, right? So what I do is I'll take and I find the seam here. See the seam right here? I'm going to push my nail in there just like this. Watch. Right in here. You see that? And then all I got to do is pull it and it pops open. You see that? Very simple. Let me show you again. I'm going to shut it and see those little ripples? I put my thumbnail in there and I pull it and it pops. Okay. Now, now what you have to do to get it open is you got to lift it up like that. All right. And you're going to see there's channels here and here, right? And if you look on here, you're going to see one here and one there. All right. So when you put it on like this, you got to find them because if you don't, it rides until you find it. And then you look down here and this kind of clicks in there. When you push it, it locks. So go, let's go ahead and change these batteries. Pop. So I'm going to open it up. We know how to open it now, right? And then if you look inside, you're going to see you've got two batteries. These are have run out of steam. So what we've got to do is we're going to stick our finger in here right at the top, kind of push down a little bit and pop it out. Let's see if I can get it from this side. All right, there we go. There's the negative side. Put it over here. I'm going to do the same thing on this one here. I'm going to come in on this this side here. Try, oh, shit. This one's hard to get at. Okay, I got it. You see, I got my fingernail in there. I'm going to pop it out. Bam, I got it. All right, now, if you look in there, you're going to see that the spring is where the negative side of the battery goes. Let me grab two new Duracells. All right, so because I use the Duracell because they're pretty good. That's the triple A. If you look on the Duracell, you're going to see it says triple A. You see that? All right, and this is the negative side. That's the positive side. So when you look in, in your remote, you've got to get the negative side against that spring. So let's go ahead and push it in there. That one's in, okay? Let's get our other one. Now, usually they go the opposite direction. So the spring's on this side. So let's put it in, push it down, bam. And now we just get our cap. We slide it over until it gets to those little holes, just like that, and bam, Bob's your uncle. Now this sucker's ready to play. Now we can go ahead and use it. Now here's the key thing about this. When you buy this, it's ready to go. You don't have to pair it with your TV. It just works which is kind of cool. I'm going to show you right now. Okay, here we go. All right, so there's my TV. And if you look on the very top right here, that's your universal power button. So if I point it at the TV and I press that, it's going to turn on. There you go. Bam, Bob's your uncle. We're on.